Hello guys, here is Akil Mew from DynamicSkills.com and today I'm going to show you how we can restore or migrate our website, WordPress websites using Backup Buddy. Uh, in this video, I will show you restore, how to restore. So, what you need, first of all, you need to download your upload files to your hosting server and uh, set up a new database and uh, third option is run upload and run importbuddy.php file and uh, then follow the instructions and complete six import setup steps okay uh, that's it so in my case in this video I have already uploaded files to my control panel and here is here you can see I you can upload your files using uh, file manager as well as filezilla I use filezilla it's very convenient and free FTP client and download you can download from website and also you need to uh, upload import buddy .php. if you have not seen you just need to go WP content and then there is a temporary file uh, named on uh, like this when you okay here is your path go to backup buddy called wp content and uploads and here is a backup buddy dot uh, underscore temp file and here is and something xx file uh, file in my case nv1 m1 view okay and here copy import buddy dot php file okay then upload to the the main directory where the backup file is located and now I and let's start going to here is upload or just type import buddy.php and then hit or enter or go to the one this file okay now you need to give password okay enter your password and then you can see backup in home upload a backup restore from stash stash live I mean, we are already have uploaded a backup file and there is a full backup file complete backup file and now what I hear if I restore from this it take uh, time as there is a size to 228 MBs so I but I do I extract my file, zip file here, and uh, it is very fast. It's convenient for me. Uh, extract in home directory. Okay, and wait for extraction completion. Uh, complete, uh, and yet it's complete, and then you can go to the backup buddy. Import back to buddy files. Okay, in case all file extracted and now I'm going to select advanced option and skip unzipping or opening archive because I already man, uh, manually and extract the files okay and close and now click on restore backup okay and now you need to wait a, a few minutes to complete the uh, setup uh, okay now third step is uh, to put details uh, uh, database we already I have already created few if you do not know about your database you need to go to MySQL and create follow the uh, MySQL databases and create your database as I have already database created in my folder in my databases and here is my database I'm going to use for this website so 
localhost is my server path where is my sql located and then okay and now here is my password of okay username and uh, okay ms okay now i'm going to click on next step let's go now we need to wait to complete step 4 restoring database and now backup body is restoring our database so I need to wait and going to pass this view okay now path I need to simple URL because I'm going to come from uh, my mutual graphics to mutual graphics only changing the hosting not a URL so I'm going to click on next step now migrating database migrating database successfully now verify import side functionality before proceeding to clean up so I'm click on the website and need to now okay now refresh my website here you can see our website is working fully functional fully and I have restored my website successfully uh, every URL is working correctly that's it now I'm going to no, I'm going to as we can see the setup is successfully now we need to clear backup zip file and read tools and it is a operation cleanup and so I need to click on finish cleanup okay let's take a few minutes few seconds or so few minutes and that's it and now our backup and restore uh, sorry restoration and migration is successfully completed and you can see our web server working correctly thank you for watching bye bye